This is something that comes easy to some people and is really challenging for others, and that thing is to be genuine. What does that mean, to be genuine, to be yourself? I mean, uh, there's a famous quote by Oscar Wilde, be yourself, everybody else is already taken. And I love the idea behind that because uh, I'll relate this to a personal story of mine, which is I used to think, you know, I had this vision of like what a big time writer director was. Um, or just even just when I got into directing, moving on from just only being a writer, you know, I, I thought, you know, I had this vision in my head of what a director was. And I just thought of that asshole and entourage who's like, he, he causes a scene, his ego is bigger than the room. He's a, he's a dick basically. And, and, and I never felt like I need to be a dick to be a director, but there was something about even though it was uh, obviously it was uh, satirized to an extent, it's hyperbole, but there's something about having that edge, having that energy, you know, that sort of like unforgettableness. When you walk into a room, people stop, they notice you. And how important is that? Well, how important is that? Is it important at all? There was a time when I was asking myself, do I need to update my outfit? Do I need to change my hair? Do I need to basically create a character? Do I need to create a persona and that is me? Like that's the director me, that's the me that's gonna take over the room that no one's gonna be able to say no to, that's gonna get all the work, that's gonna make the best projects. And I really thought that, that I, I was gonna have to do that. I was researching it. I'm like, well, who is the new me? It was kind of exciting. Am I gonna have a lot of tattoos? Am I gonna just wear like brightly colored jumpsuits? Am I gonna become a sneakerhead now? What am I going to do? Am I going to wear kilts? Uh, you know, am I going to wear makeup? We don't want, I literally anything, there was nothing off the table because this was a blank slate. I got, got to have an opportunity to be anybody I wanted to be. And that's a very sexy concept. You know, if someone asks you, who do you want to be? Or, or, or not even ask you, who do you want to be? Even better, you're going to become someone else, but you get to choose it. Well, don't we already choose it? Don't we choose that every day? <laughs> And I think that, yes, we do choose it, but choosing who you are, which you already do, and owning it, then just embracing it and being it, well, that's being genuine. And there is an element of being genuine, which is, of course, you know, wearing your heart on your sleeve, being accessible, being vulnerable. And so that is all wrapped up in the concept of being genuine. But I've learned and you know maybe there's there are people out there who create a persona and that works great for them and good for you but for me how i work how i create and how i live my life are pretty much indistinguishable there's no lines delineating those areas of my life and so to me it's always been important to just embrace me the good the bad the stuff i need to work on the stuff i'll never be good at the stuff i'm great at and that is the key to being genuine. And when you're genuine, people will be drawn to you much more and they will remember you much more than if you come in with a crazy, crazy look and try to command the room with some sort of shtick or persona. And I'm sticking to it. So be you, everybody else is already taken.